I mean, final map. And if you haven't been feeling you've been playing as good as you normally do, I mean, Rafa said he had some problems as well mm. with a negative Excel. Check your settings. Yeah, Cypher's definitely not feeling happy. And, you know, he's been so solid throughout this tournament. Sparty as well. We've seen some yeah. amazing games from him. This could and be the finals, all, to be honest. You the know last I mean? two maps, he was great as go. well. Here we go. Cypher is apparently ready now. He doesn't even try it again. He's going to warm up. He's just like, I'm ready to do this one. So it's third and final map. Cypher versus Sparty for a place in the winner's bracket final. A winner bracket final. And uh, off the start, we see Sparty, of course, getting himself red armor. Oh, and that's a great rocket once again. Is he going to risk going through? No, he's not. He, he's got to watch out about going forward there as well, if he did, because he didn't have much speed to him, and he would have been an easy rail shot. So I think he was just waiting to see if Cypher was going to make a move, um, as obviously Red Armor is the next item up. Spidey could rocket jump to it, but that would be risky right now, as Cypher could come in with rockets. But there you go, oh Cypher! Oh, my God. Hits a rail. Must have looked like it could have been through the, the grates. I'm not sure. The rocket hit first, yeah. right? And rail to rocket. But Sparty jumped, rocket jumps same. as well at the same time. Amazing start from there Cypher is. there. And that little challenge that Cypher laid down. Try and get a frag. Oh my god. 100% rail gun. One minute in. Someone annoyed Cypher. Yeah, don't piss Cypher off. A lesson learned. But of course, he doesn't want to fire his rail because he wants to keep his 100%. That's why. Oh, I hate that spawn. He's going to go up as well. Mega soon, though. Nice play from Scythe. You can cut that one off. Easy. There it is. Bam! Brilliant again from Scythe. And testing out that little uh, his sensitivity for that 180 turn. Apparently worked out perfect for him. No! <laughs> Don't worry, Joseph. He hit more railguns. Yeah, but you can't go to 100 anymore. I want to see a pro game when someone gets 100% rail. But well, there's Sparty anyway. And uh, there's his frag that Cypher dared him to get. Yeah, and now, you know, this map, you can... You know, it can be very one-sided when someone's in control, so don't write off Sparty just because of Cypher's great start, as Cypher will kill himself. Sparty off the spawn, that's a crazy good LG, and brilliant place Rocket. Jumping to get the shot, covering the railgun. Oh my God. And look at that, 4-3, these guys are geared up and ready to go for this game. What a fantastic match. Well, Sparty misses the jump to ready. Actually turned out to be a bit of a blessing yeah. for him. Cypher didn't expect him to be he right knows where he is face. as well. That is oh, such again, a great move oh. from Sparty. And Cypher will jump off to the side. Amazing rockets. The tires all up at 4-4. Sparty's a little bit wary of that rail. Of course, he is railable at the moment. Only 59 HP. Wow, and Cypher's so Cypher. good at playing aggressive, but wow, Sparty handled that brilliantly. Any other player wouldn't have even expected um, Cypher to be that you know, fast into getting those railgun angles and take the shots, but Sparty was ready for it, hitting a 55% railgun himself. Lost out on Mega, though, and Yellow. So, so Cypher does have a slight advantage. Sparty, though, with one railgun can kind of even that one up. And he's also got his back to where the red armor is, so if he can get that, He's going to be happy, but he's got to be careful because he can hear Cypher below him. Cypher unlucky not to combo the rocket to rail. Mega soon. Mistake from Sparty. Actually, rocket jumps rather than uh, hitting his target. There was Mega forced away, and actually Cypher gets the rail off. But nice he's placed hurt. by Sparty. Yeah, one more and he's dead. Where is he at? He's got, yeah, he's just got the... Uh... Nice, brilliant oh, amazing move. Amazing from Sparty. Unlucky not to get the kill, and there it is, it's a double, and I think Cypher's going to be happier with that situation, but off the spawn, he does not get the red, and he hasn't yet got the railgun, so he's even a little bit careful about where he wants to go now, and I think sparty has got to be happy with that situation. Nice play from Cypher here, that's a really good way to get in on the rail, and he can do some damage onto Mega, so brilliant stuff. Damage? Yep. Kill me. And Sparty almost making the same mistake, he is actually going to go up. This time, Cypher going to get the better of that one again, I would say. But, of course, this time keeps his life. He's gone past the six-minute remaining mark. Cypher takes a grenade to the face. Only got 50 HP now after that bubble he's picked up. And somehow still hanging on. Sparty spamming grenades left, right and centre. Red and Mega are going to be coming up fairly oh. soon together at the same time. Cypher backed away towards Mega. Cypher! Oh, amazing Brilliant. again. 
this this game is just absolutely brilliant. Yeah, I think, as I said, it could be the finals here of the whole Ultimate Gaming Championships with the way that these two are playing. Cypher in a better situation right now, up to 140 armor. Nice pick up some health bubbles. Sparty does have all the weapons, but not so healthy. But that's a really good rocket. That's 100 damage. Gonna go LG. Cypher's gonna win that one. And had he pulled LG out earlier, as you can see, 42 health left, he probably could have won it. But he hesitated. He looked like he wanted a rocket shot. And now Cypher's going to start to pull away with the scoreline. 11 to 6, and this is where Cypher's going to try and get most of his frags, I'm sure. As he's really got a good stack and rotation. As long as he doesn't get a spawn at Railgun, he'll be able to cover Red pretty easily. Get that. And that's a weird move by Sparty, but wow, works out so nice. Yeah, really nice one. There's another great rocket down to just 34 health. Oh, and Cypher just oh, that's incredible inches that away from that. missing that rail, but the rocket wow. comes out. Sparty mega, mega. did go down. Oh, Sparty. Yeah, Sparty gets the spawn. <laughs> oh, my God. Sparty. Yeah, I mean, he deserved a good spawn off that player, the um, red armor. Hitting three rockets with no armor to your name and then gets the LG spawn kill and the mega. Of course, he hasn't got the yellow yet, but he's trying to control center map. But now Cypher's going to get in on the railgun, so we're very much even once again between these two players. But Sparty, obviously, five frags down. Oh, and again, straight through the teleporter, Sparty lands his rail. Gets one back, though. Mega, uh, sorry, red armor up in three seconds. Nice. Rail again, and Cypher is really yeah, hurt. I don't hurting. think he can afford even the, uh, the rocket jump up onto that red armor. And we're going to see now Sparty moving in, and Cypher couldn't make it onto that mega health. Of course, Red Armor is still on its platform. Cypher off the spawn down to just 44. Yeah. Yeah, Cypher, as you can see in this situation, limited in options. Almost got railed there. Looking for a 25. Doesn't get it. Takes the railgun, though. But still, this is quite a nice defensive position to be in for Cypher. He's got a lot of options of, it, of escaping. If someone comes red, he can still land some damage. Looking for a lucky rocket. If Sparty was making the jump over, and now we'll take another 25. So, great play from Sparty on the defense with three minutes left to go. He's definitely uh, earned that 50 armor. And if he can get more, well, good for him. But right now, Sparty, 200, 200. And we've seen how Cypher can play out of control here on Arrow. What we saw it against Cooler at QuakeCon. An amazing performance that he put in there. But, will he be able to do it here against Sparty? There's another red. Nicely railed off. Got two and a half minutes to go. He comes out and look how much wow. damage he's been Yeah. Given oh there. my god, Cypher. That is such a ballsy move to go back in and do some additional damage. But I'm not sure if he was thinking that the yellow was still there or just thought it would be a really nice surprise attack. But either way, he did do a lot of damage, but he still hurt himself. And they exchange rails. And, but this red armor surely should mean that Spiny has the advantage. As you can see, Cypher has oh. absolutely nothing right now. It's going to be hard to keep this score line. There's the kill. As Spidey comes through the TP, drops down with the rocket, scores himself a nice frag. Lucky that for Cypher that he didn't get hit and scored a huge amount of damage. If you look at the machine gun accuracy, 48. Oh, the rockets are amazing oh, as wow. well from Cypher. And he catches Sparty with the LG just before he gets through that teleporter. It's four frags the difference. 145 left on now the clock. If he, if he dies at this yellow, that could be it for Sparty. And he's just going to back away. Yellow's up on his spawn point. Cypher, I don't think Cypher knows it. I think he assumed it was already taken, but Sparty might be lucky enough to go back there and get it now, which he does. Cypher heard that pickup, though, so he knows what's up. If he gets this red, it's all about the mega fight. It's all about the mega now. Cypher back up to 100 health. Sparty knows after this mega, it's time to go. He has to make the push. There is the mega pickup. Yeah, I don't think he's got time to go for the yellow. I'd rather get involved, but I guess the route to yellow is the, the best way to get to the top of the map from this situation as well. So here we go, one minute. Cypher through that teleporter. He's going to wait here underneath red. And he's outsmarting Sparty in terms of position. As we hit that one minute mark, oh, almost scores the uh, rail shot as well. Sparty, let's have a look at his health and armor. Yeah, he's okay, but... Not in that much of an advantage. This map is quite easy, oh. in a way, to get away from your uh, opponent. 
Here we go. Spotty decides it's time to make the move. Mega is on its platform, and Spotty can't drop here. He's a dead man if he drops. Okay, Spot Cypher's gone away. Picked up the yellow armor. Spotty, of course, got Mega. Spotty gonna drop in behind. Can he take this one? Cypher surely extremely low. Oh, he's missed the rail. Oh. And that's it. And that's it. That's gonna be it. Cypher finishing off. Getting up to his 15th kill. But I tell you what, Sparty playing an amazing, amazing game here. Um, Cypher's still not quite down and out. Um, and that frag stayed alive, just somehow. Um, and Sparty just gonna look to finish off this uh, map at least with an extra kill or two. And there we go. Cypher will win it 2 1. 15 11 here in map number three. And he goes through to the winner bracket final to take on Rafa. Yep. And that's what, what everyone. I mean, I think wanted to see, but of course, we always want to see everyone play their best. And I think Sparty definitely gave us you know, a, a really good performance. So we'll have to see how he does in his next games in the lower bracket. Didn't say GG. Ooh.